they drink about 50 gallons of water. African elephants are never far from a source of water, so they always stay close to it. They use it for drinking, bathing, and cooling their bodies down because it's so hot in Africa. So definitely very important up there. Paragraph five, elephants are social animals. That's really important. I bet you if I underline this, that might be what the rest of this paragraph is gonna talk about. How are they social? What are they like with other elephants? They like to be around each other. There you go. Family units are made up of females and they're young, they're babies. These groups are known as herds. They're grouped together. That's a very important word. The entire herd is led by an older female. So I hope you cloud herd because these are groups of females and they're young. And the entire herd is led by an older female. She is called the matriarch, the lady boss. All of the other members of the herd are related to her. So that means they're family in a sense. Like your mom is related to you, your cousin is related to you, your family, you share blood, you share DNA. All right, so again, Annabella wants me to use a different color. Let's go to paragraph six, right here, all right? Older male elephants may live by themselves. Mm -hmm. So the males are kind of mm, not very social like the female. Or they may live with other males in small groups. Oh, okay. So maybe they do, but maybe smaller groups. They meet up with females only to mate. That means to procreate or have other baby elephants. A female gives birth to a single calf at a time. So one baby elephant at a time. The baby lives closely with its mother for several years. Pretty cool. Go to paragraph seven right here. African elephants cover a huge territory. Mm. They are found in most areas of Africa, south of the Sahara Desert. Sahara Desert is a huge desert full of sand and it's so hot. When I was 16, I went there and it was impressive. Some live in forest areas, other live in grasslands. So. I'm going to highlight or underline this sentence because it's telling us kind of like where they like to roam around or live. And some details that support that is in the Saharan desert or some forest areas or some grasslands. All found in Africa. All right. So number eight, paragraph eight. There are about 500,000 elephants in Africa today. This may sound like a big number, but the elephant population is much smaller than it used to be. There were once as many as three to five million elephants in Africa. So this is pretty sad that from three to five million, there's only about 500,000. That is huge. That is a huge drop. Oh, I see. I see a text feature right here. You can box that heading. This is a heading. We see the photograph right here, which is another text feature. And we see the little caption, image three, an, elef an African elephant in Botswana uses its trunk to grasp and pull a tree branch. See how useful their trunk is? Botswana is a place in Africa. It looks so beautiful there. Number nine. African elephants face several dangers today. One is loss of land. People are building on the land where elephants like to live. This pushes the animals out. So definitely this section right here is gonna be about how we can protect the remaining 500,000 African elephants that are um, in the world today. And we can see that they face several dangers today. And this is the main idea right here because then it's going to give us some reasons or some facts about why they're in danger. One of it is loss of land. Another is people are building on the land where elephants like to live. So they're kind of pushing the elephants out. Um, another threat is poaching or illegal hunting. This is a huge one. 
This is the one I was telling you about. For many years, people have hunted African elephants for their tusks. See their tusks right here? Tusks are made of ivory. This material, and you can cloud that if you forgot what that word means, but you can see it. That this is how the photograph, that text feature of the photograph helps us learn what things mean. Tusks are made of ivory. This material has been used to make many things from jewelry to piano keys. Today, it is against the law to sell ivory because we don't wanna keep killing elephants to get that. That is because of an agreement between many countries. They knew the sale of ivory was putting elephants at risk. So they came together to stop it. So this is very important. 11, several African countries have taken steps to protect elephants. So this is very good. This is a very important detail right here because then we're gonna read how they're taking steps to protect them. They have set aside land for animals. So it's protected, nobody can build there. These protected areas are called reserves. These are reserves. Land that are just for animals to live in peace are reserves. Tourists like to visit these places. They can see the elephants in their natural setting. Many efforts to protect elephants have been successful. However, poaching is still a problem. The African elephant is still at risk today. So if poaching is still a problem, that means somebody's breaking the law and um, endangering more elephants. So I'm sure that everybody's trying really hard to make sure that they are all safe. Um, all right, so that is a long text. Kind of, we've read a lot of important information right there. Um, what you need to do is, I advise you to go back, rewind, read it again with me or listen to it again, and then you're going to answer questions one, two, three, four, and five. And please remember that if you see these lines, you're supposed to write your response and in a complete sentence. What is one piece of information that you can find under the heading habitat? There is a heading of habitat right here, right here on this right here. Do you see the heading habitat? It's one other heading that, and then there's paragraph seven and eight for habitat. So you will find some information there. What is one piece of information that you can find? And you start with a complete sentence. One piece of information under habitat is, can you continue? What is one piece of information that you can find under the heading protect the animals, the elephants. Just like I wrote on top of here, you write in a complete sentence, one piece of information under the heading protect the elephants is, okay? Very important to write in a complete sentence. Reread the fact box in the article, image two, right here. This is image two. This right here, this is a fact box. What are two, 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 two pieces of information that you can learn about the African elephant from reading this box? You can start one piece of, one important piece is that, and then you could say the second, important fact or piece is, and then complete that sentence, okay? All right, guys, lots of work today. You're gonna do great. Have an amazing learning day. Love this topic. Elephants are so cool to learn about. You got this. Bye, see you tomorrow.